From Pride and Prejudice to Persuasion to Emma, Jane Austen has left a long-lasting impression on the world of literature. Now, a book written in her honour, Jane Austen's England, A Walking Guide, pays tribute to Jane's love for walking and the places she enjoyed visiting. She loved walking. She called herself a desperate walker. And she had to walk. They were not rich. So she walked to shop, visit her friends, and she also walked for pleasure. At the event, Jane Austen fans had the opportunity to ask the author any burning questions. The mayor, who was also at the launch, told us about how the 200th anniversary of Jane's death has made this a unique mayoral term. Um, Jane Austen's effect this year has been phenomenal in, with the Guildhall, uh, with Winchester Cathedral, which has been absolutely fantastic, with the launch of the new £10 note, with the cathedral on it and Jane Austen. It's been a fantastic year. I thought, yes, to this event. And it's certainly happening most entertaining, listening to her talking about Jane Austen and also the dancers. It was really, really lovely. Jane's death has also had other influences. The Hampshire Regency dancers also performed dances from Jane's era at the launch. Nobody had danced these dances for nearly 200 years, so it was, I think, quite right to reintroduce them. They were written now, we could see the music, and we could see what was done, but nobody had actually done it. So our task was to bring it to life. With this year being the 200th anniversary of Jane Austen's death, events like these make sure her legacy lives on. Rebecca Dearson, Winchester News Online, Eastleigh.